yellow um, before you ask. I am mentally stable even though I don't look like I would be right now. Um, it's been a little bit, <laughs> roughly like a while since I've been back. Since you've last seen me, I've got my nose pierced. I'm now not working 60 hour weeks. Got a, got a tattoo, another one, which you guys don't know I have one on my foot. It's fine. Um, what else? Removing buildings at work, so that's really <laughs> not stressful. Went to Mexico. Best friend got engaged. That's about it. You know, I was given a deadline by my mother to uh, clean my bathroom because <laughs> I'm an adult and I live with my parents, uh, as any 22 year old would, and I thought, you know, why not capitalize off of this opportunity, pretty much. But the last little bit of my bathroom that I do have to clean is my makeup, because I've been keeping a stack of makeup here to use every single day, instead of having to go to my like stash and dig it out and things have infil infiltrated, uh, that kind of stuff. So I thought, you know what? Why not take a page out of Jamie Page's book and just film it, you know? Makes me have proof that I've cleaned it. So currently have a shit ton of stuff here. We'll go through it, see what I want to use every day, see what I don't, talk about the good stuff, the bad stuff. So let's get into it. So this is the current situation. It's a lot. So I'm just gonna start. So brushes, I don't need all of them. So I'm gonna keep a few. These are the three bins that I utilize for my everyday stuff. I just got them at like Big Lots. So brushes, I'm gonna keep my MAC 217 out, my Morphe M502, and my Morphe M508. These are the three that I'm just gonna keep out and these the rest will be needing to be cleaned and then I'll put them back well I'm gonna put them back then clean them how does that sound just gonna put them over there for the time being um, god this is stressful my Apple watch charger I need this but also I need to find my Apple watch first move this into here I guess with my hair stuff Mario Badescu facial face spray. Put this with my skincare stuff over in that corner. One of the best perfumes, Tom Ford Violet Orchard. Putting it with my other perfumes. I don't want to keep this over here. Thinking about getting rid of it. Uh, I'm not going to keep my Tarte. I'm not going to keep my Milk Kush. This is the Tarte Creaseless Concealer. This is the new packaging one. I'm not going to keep that. That was my everyday. This is the Milk Kush Mascara. Not gonna keep this every day. I'm not the biggest fan of it. Not gonna keep my Marc Jacobs co Lip Color Stick and Heartbreaker. Um, use that for Mexico. Lotion, I'm gonna put over here. My diffuser. Should probably just relocate that bad boy. I've been using my NARS Laguna bronzer for the past few months. I'm gonna switch it out for another one. So the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, lip gloss in Neon Apple. Um, I'm gonna put that back. The YSL lipstick in Rouge, Rouge Percator in 01, I think. It's just like a sample. It's a red hot color. I'm gonna put that back. The MAC Lip Glass in Very Go Lightly. I'm going to put that back as well. That's garbage. My first little container here. This is where I usually keep my tools, brushes, sponges, that kind of stuff, sprays. I'm going to put the Jaclyn Hill palette back. I think I'm going to pull out the Natasha Denona one. I'm going to keep my large Real Techniques um, sponge. I need to clean it really badly. I'm going to toss that in the sink. I'm going to keep the Morphe M529 to use for highlight. Always need this um, curling lashes. This is a sample size of the Lar NARS Laguna. I'm going to put that away. Keeping my blush brush, my Morphe stippling brush. I'm going to keep this e.l.f. big powder brush just in case I need to blend out. I'm going to keep this eye brush as well from Essence. And I'm going to keep the MAC um, Oval 6 brush. Um, I'm going to keep my Urban Decay Chill Setting Spray. That's what I like to use to set. And then I'm also going to keep my Lavender and Water and Glycerin from Heritage Store. 
um because i like to use this to prep my skin and i'm gonna put the brushes that i picked out of my main brush supply put them in here this is my second drawer that i utilize this is mostly i like to put it as like face cream like cream stuff first one i have is the bobby brown vitamin enriched face base um this is a primer that i use do i want to keep it or no i'm not going to keep it i'm going to put it back for the time being um this is the shiseido sports bb broad spectrum and sunscreen i'm going to put this back because i'm going to keep my milk sunshine skin tint um which has spf 30 in it i'm going to keep this because it's good i really like it i think still lana davison um smashbox primerizer i'm gonna keep i'm almost out i'm gonna keep that one so i can use it up and then i think i'm gonna get the milk um hydro grip instead nars long wear radiant long wear foundation in the shade Gobi. i think i'm gonna keep this in case i need full coverage for right now I have to keep the Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter. This is in the color 2. It is my go-to cream highlight. It's my go-to highlight, honestly. It's so good. If you don't have this, you need it. This is my um, Becca Opal. It's a small one. And it, these always crack on me, which is really sad. I'm going to keep this one because we're getting into the um, kind of summery months. Well, it's April. It's going to get warmer in Seattle, so I'm going to keep this. This is the Lorac... Um, illuminating highlighter in daylight. This is a beautiful highlighter. I'm gonna put this one back because I'm keeping the Becca Opal. This is the Charlotte Tilbury um, Airbrush Flawless Finishing Skin Perfecting Powder. Hit pan on that one. I'm gonna keep this because I've been using this to just gently set my under eyes because recently I haven't been setting my under eyes because nothing makes it not crease. This is the Stila Stay All Day Contouring Bronzer for face and body in dark. Um, I just pulled this out again and have been using it and I really, really like it. It gave me a really good like bronze the other day. So I'm gonna keep this instead of my NARS Laguna. I'm gonna keep my Lancome Monsieur Big Mascara. It's in waterproof. This is, doesn't transfer to my under eyes, so. This is my Glossier Skin Tint in the color Light. I am going to dock this for the time being. I've been using this mostly to mix into my foundations and that kind of stuff, like as an additive, just to give the glass finish. But since I have that milk one, I'm gonna just utilize that and then put this away. My Glossier Stretch Concealer in light. I'm gonna put this back for the time being. I might bring it out next month. The Smashbox BB Camera Ready Water in Fair Light. I am going to put this back and I'll pull it out again later. The NARS Soft Matte in Light 2 Vanilla. I'm gonna keep this. Good concealer. The Glossier boy brow in black i'm gonna keep i'm gonna keep my tarp shape tape in fair neutral i'm gonna keep this um i've been using that i pulled it back out and been using it a little bit more the mark jacobs highlighter gel crayon it's a solid black liner um i'm gonna keep that because i utilize this to tight line my waterline um i'm gonna put back the urban decay 24 glide on pencil and perversion um it's a really good black liner it's just really pigmented and i don't want it for every day i'm gonna have to keep my precisely my brow pencil from benefit this is in the shade six this is my go-to brow um right now i have the anastasia soft glam palette i'm going to put this back and then like i said pull out that natasha denona palette so now that this is empty i'm just gonna put back my creams that i already have out so just put that one over there and i'm going to then pull out this one this is the last one that i have and i usually use it for bronzers powders that kind of stuff and just like finishing touches this is the hourglass veil powder finishing powder for right now i'm gonna put that back because i haven't been setting my under eyes and i'm just gonna utilize that charlotte tilbury this is a new lip product that i got it's maybelline color Reach shine in glossy fawn i just got this and i'm gonna keep that this is my tarte blush in party a good you know pinky neutral i think i'm going to 
put it back and I'm going to exchange it because this has been my go-to blush for so long. I'm going to exchange it with another blush that I have. This is the Milk Makeup Baked Bronzer. It's the cream bronzer. I'm going to keep this out for now. I'm still trying to figure out if I like it or not. And maybe with the summer months, it'll change my mind somehow. This is the MAC Painterly Paint Pot. I'm keeping this out because this is my eyeshadow primer. This is the Armani Beauty, Armani Runway, excuse me, um, Bounce Eyeshadow Gel in the shade 2. This is a beautiful, beautiful eyeshadow topper. So I am going to put this back because if I'm going to pull out that Natasha Denona, Denona Gold Palette, I'm going to not need that. This is my Anastasia Beverly Hills Cream Contouring Palette in light. I'm going to put this back because I'm not, I haven't been using it that much. This is the Tom Ford Cream and Powder Eyeshadow Color in Naked Bronze. This is cream powder it's amazing i'm gonna keep this because it's just a quick easy way to get a like smoky neutral eye this is the smashbox trio eyeshadow palette in nude pick deep i'm gonna put this back for now because i haven't really been using it so now that that's empty i'm gonna put my powders in it this is the tarte lights camera lashes mascara um i'm gonna put this back these are socks. They need to go to my laundry room. I'm gonna put my Essence pencil sharpener in the top here. So now this is what we have. So tools, kind of base. So I have my foundation, concealer, primer. Down here I have my bronzers, powders, extra little eyeshadows, highlight, mascara, and eyeliner. So I need to get a blush. And I'm going to look at another primer I have because I took that Bobbi Brown out. So just want to switch that up. So now I'm going to pull out a few lip products that I know I'm going to use. I'm going to automatically pull out my Make It Forever Aqua Lip in 3C. So I'm going to pull this out. I'm going to pull out my YSL Rouge Shine in the number 9, I believe. I'm going to keep this L'Oreal Color Reese Shine in 900 out. I'm going to keep my MAC Jamie Genevieve lipstick out. And I'm going to keep my Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Lip Pencil in Deep out. I'm also going to keep my MAC Shrimpton Satin Lipstick out. Even though this and the Jamie Genevieve one are very similar, I'm just going to keep this out as well. And then just in case, I'm going to pull this e.l.f. gloss out in Natural, just in case I want a glossy lip. So the rest of my nudes are going to go back. Same with all of these nudes, they're going to go back as well. So I'm just going to keep these out. Because let's be real, I'm probably not going to use a bright color. So I'm going to go put this back and then we will grab other stuff. So now I'm back and I'm going to put all of this stuff back into its right foot place. And then I'm going to find the needed items. We'll just bust through this really quickly. Okay, so now I'm back and I have the remaining stuff. So I put the other stuff away and I sorted out the stuff I was going to bring back. So I'm just going to... So I pulled out the um, NYX Honey Do Me Up primer. I'm going to re-implement this into my routine, I think. So for blush, I brought out the Laura Geller Baked Blush and Brightening and Honeysuckle. Um, the packaging's broke, so I have to use rubber bands. The other blush that I brought out is the Bare Minerals Gen Nude in that peach though. So a nice peachy coral color. And then I brought out my Natasha Denona Gold Palette, which we all know. So hoping to implement this more into my routine. So this is the finished monthly clean. So I have all my tools, my base, my bronzer, etc. down here. This is what it looks like now. It'll probably be a disaster in a month, but these are the products I'm going to go through and use every single month. We have just very simplistic, not too much stuff. We are now cleaned, which is great. All right, so we're all clean. We're all sorted. My mom won't get mad at me now. Um, so those are the products that I'm keeping for this month. We'll see what I implement next month. Hoping like every month to just sort through and go through this and double check and see and implement new products. So I hope you enjoyed. If you have any thoughts or product re recommendations, let me know and I will see you guys next time.
Deuces. Oh, God. No. Bye. <laughs>